what's up y'all if you're looking for that ace hood trials and tribulations uh the link is in the description below the itunes link this is just my review you don't have to watch this but since you're on here you might as well check it out yeah so anybody who uh watches my reviews you know how i do what i do is i go over the songs that stand out the most to me and then at the end i give like a slight review i'm on this one i'm gonna do a little different and I'm gonna tell you why once I get done with it. But I'm gonna go over the songs that I actually like. Um, the songs that I like was another statistic. We out ya, of course this single. Uh, the come up featuring Anthony Hamilton. Hope, pray for me. Uh, Bugatti, Mama. Uh, Bugatti remix and fuck the world. That's nine tracks and there's seventeen songs. Uh, those songs I liked. I like uh, Dear Mama a lot. Of course, We Out Here. Yeah, I like that a lot. And uh, I think Pray for Me. Those were the ones I liked a lot. Uh, the other ones, I, there's some songs on there that I also like that I didn't name, but those are the ones I liked a lot. I said I'm gonna do this review different because I'm just gonna break the album down. To me, just to me. I don't know why. I think Ace his last album, it was pretty good. People just slept on it. It had a lot of singles that could have made it mainstream or did do good mainstream. Uh, to me, this this album had like more of a mixtape feel. By that, what I mean is it just didn't feel like an album. Um, it's hard for me to explain. You know, his mixtape format, that's what it felt like. You know, the hard beats. Uh, pretty much he's talking about the same thing but that's what he does you know that's his, his format but to me um maybe I was expecting something different I'm not sure but there's a cup like some stuff to me just sound the same you know what I'm saying like the it seems like the same beats he's saying the same thing it's kind of like to me you can pretty much predict what he's gonna you know what I'm saying what he's gonna say not to say the songs are trash, cause the beats are hard. Like the production on here, you know, Ace Hood he has the hard beats, and you know he pretty much rides them, or he, you know, he sings with auto tune on the hook. So for the most part, he has like a lot of catchy songs and real, real hard beats. You feel what I'm saying? And out of 17, I like nine a lot. I feel, I do feel that you can play it from beginning to end. You know, you can vibe. But to me, just from like hearing, you know, Starvation 3 and, you know, his other mixtapes, that's just what it sound like. Like when I press play to listen to it, it just didn't seem like an album to me. Just to me, it just seemed like a mixtape. Um, besides a few songs that I named. And again, there's nothing wrong with having the hard songs at times, but I feel like, you know, J. Cole, uh, Jay-Z, Wale, Kanye, you know, all of them, like, listen to their, their albums, you know, to me, they sound like albums, like, they had, like, some, some epic songs, some classic songs, you know, songs with, uh, how can I, I don't want to say songs with, with substance, or just, for instance, let me see, like, Bound To on Kanye album, when I heard that, I was like, whew, tough, or, um, Cricket Smile on uh, J. Cole album, or the song with him and Kendrick. And, you know, Wale, Vanity. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, Jay-Z, he had a couple songs like that. I just didn't get that same feeling from this from this album. To me, it feel like uh, Ace Hood has that same format. You know, it's just the same. Maybe it's just me, but like I said, it's just the same format ever since Hustle Hard. It, it seemed like nothing is... He switched up, but to me, Ace Hood is dope. Like I feel like a lot of people sleep on him. His last album was real good. It's like people just not buying Ace Hood albums. You feel what I'm saying? I think Ace Hood is dope personally. You feel me? Like I said, I can play it from beginning to end and let it ride. But to me, it just seemed like it's the same format. You feel me? But with that being said, um, it seemed like the album to me. Like I'm not gonna play it too too much. You see what I'm saying? Cause it, it all sounds pretty much the same to me. You know, the heartbeat, it just has a mixtape feel. But with that being said, if I had to rate it from 1 to 10, I would give it like a uh, like a 7.5. My personal opinion, I give it a 7.5. Uh, heartbeats, 
you know what I'm saying? Him, he rides the beat. And like I said, if you're a, a Ace Hood fan, I do think you'll like it. But it's just a lot of people who's not buying a Ace Hood albums. He usually have great singles. Bugatti, We Out Chill. He always has uh, singles that either get a plaque or something like that, but his albums just never sell. You know what I'm saying? And then the situation with his uh, his watch really didn't make it like no better. But my personal opinion, it's it's pretty it's pretty hard. Like the the beats, like Young Chop, um, you know the the typicals that he used. So with that being said, let me know what I think. Maybe it's me, but I give it a seven and a half. I think you can really um rock with the album and know anybody say, oh man, he think it's tr-. no, I do not think it's trash. It's just the same to me, man. I think Ace Hood. I think he's dope. I really think he can. It, it, it just wasn't this album, man. I think he he really needs that album to show he's versatile and he can uh, you know, he can. People need to rock with him for real, for real. And I don't I don't think it was that this album right here. I think I like his last album better. Well, I know I do. So with that being said, let me know what y'all think. Comment. You feel the same way? What's your favorite song? And what would you rate it one to ten, man? You know, everybody have their own opinions. You don't have to agree with me. You know what I'm saying? All you got to do is, you know, comment. Let's talk about it. But me personally, I think the album's cool. We keep getting straight albums, good albums. So we'll see what happens. Comment. Let's talk about it.